This segment is sponsored by iCairo Clinics. Sports is a game of inches. What you do matters. And there are things you can do to kind of optimize performance when you consider those inches. Dr. Michael Quast owns iCairo Clinics, and he is here to tell us a bit more about that game of inches. What do you mean by that, Dr. Quast? Sports is a game of inches. Yeah, well, when you look at sports, I mean, I can give you an example. When I was high jumping at Michigan State, the difference between a walk-on and a full-ride scholarship at a Big Ten school was four inches. Wow. So four inches, you were jumping here, you were a full ride, you were down here, you were a walk-on over wow. four inches. And so people don't think about this, but really in any sport, um, it's all timing. It's all little minute movements. And what people don't realize is if you have a restriction in any of those movements, you're not going to perform as well. And what do you mean you by know, a restriction? I, uh, so, for example, um, maybe I can't reach my shoulder out as far as it should. Uh, but as the person, I don't even know that because who's measuring any of that, yeah. right? We see people come in all the time that have restricted ranges of motion where they can't bend or move a certain way, but they don't even know um, because it's not like they're going to the hospital. They're not crying about it. It doesn't hurt. Uh, they often are not even aware of it. So we do all of our tests to find these range of motion restrictions because then you can imp improve performance. Mm. You know, if you think about it, like if I'm running into the end zone to dive in and catch a, a touchdown pass, if my shoulder's a little a little tight, which is what all the patients always say, I'm just a little tight, like that's yeah. not a big deal, right? You just missed. But if I have full range of motion, I just fingertipped it, caught it, won the Super Bowl, everybody gets a ring and five million dollars and everybody's happy, right? It's all like range of <laughs> it's all range of motion related. And we just see it time and time again. You know, we just had a little kid come in, big soccer player, but his hips are really restricted. Uh, we got his improvement on this hips and the mom and dad are like, he is playing so much better. Um, we even had a kid uh, at one of the colleges here in town and he's a pitcher and he just happened to be at our office and we tested his range of motion. Um, he was actually picking up his, his girlfriend there. So he wasn't even a patient, but we <laughs> talked and I'm like, we did that shoulder test that I always show people where yes. you try to touch your hands behind your back. He couldn't do it on the one side. So we did some of the soft tissue work that we do. Um, he was able to get that range of motion back. And, you know, he didn't think nothing of it. He was kind of blowing it off because he feels fine and he's a college athlete. So he's like invincible. Um, well, he comes in the next week and he goes, you're not going to believe it. He goes, I threw the fastest I've ever thrown all weekend at our tournament. Mm. And he's, he's a pitcher. So these range of motion things matter and they actually make the difference uh, if you think about any sport. Think about golf. If you're swinging, you know, it's timing. It's how well all those muscles are working as you're moving through. And if something's a little, a little tight, you're not going to perform as well. What kinds of things are you doing, Dr. Quest, to restore range of motion, to work out the, the kinks and the quirks? Yeah. So the first step is to do the testing. And we talk about that all the time, but the testing is what tells you where the problem is, especially if it's not symptomatic and you're not hurting right so we're trying to find any restrictions in motion and then address those with you know whatever techniques we need to do we, we kind of combine everything we can together it's not just chiropractic it's massage therapy it's exercise therapy it's it's stretching um it's different physiotherapy types of things that we can do you know any any uh anything we can do that's going to get that range of motion back that's what we're going to do mm -hmm. so like our product is not doing like an adjustment on a person our product is restoring whatever that range of motion problem is because if you don't have the motion you're not going to perform as well and as we all get older you're going to lose it even more, which leads to arthritis, degeneration, and, and bigger problems. Mm. All right. Whether or not you are an athlete, if you are having restrictions in your range of motion, go see a member of Dr. Quast's team uh, for more information or to schedule an appointment, visit iChiroclinics.com. Dr. Quast, thank you. Thank you.